after the uh, three uh, snorkels here. Um, I know most of the kits that you can buy, uh, they come in four. I, I didn't want four, I wanted the three in the front. Uh, this is my son's uh, 2017 uh, 570 Sportsman. I wanted the uh, three snorkels in the front to match my, uh, my high lifter Sportsman. So what I what I did, uh, I made my own. Um, as you can see, I used a one and a half inch uh, ABS or PVC, whatever you want to use. Uh, that's a 22 degree angle uh, on the top there. To um, as you can see, uh, it tilts them back. Uh, and then I've uh, I've purchased the actually I had them given to me. Uh, the high lifter um, snorkel uh, tops there. Uh, so all that, that's all it is. Uh, it's the one and a half inch, uh, that's the small high lifter uh, snorkel top or the cap um, and a 22 and a half degree angle uh, down to straight and that's uh, just a one and a half inch coupler uh, up against the uh, rack and then uh, what I've done um, is I've attached uh, a three inch piece of one and a half inch ABS. I drilled a uh, one and seven eighths hole. Uh, it is a perfect snug fit. Uh, I'm not gonna open the box uh, because it, uh, I'd have to uh, disconnect the, uh, the hoses and I don't wanna do that. Uh, but underneath, um, like I said, uh, underneath that coupler, it's uh, a three inch piece of one and a half inch ABS. Uh, it goes through the snorkel lid. Um, and then underneath there, uh, there's a two inch silicone coupler um, that, uh, that attaches uh, to the, that uh, piece of hard uh, ABS and then the other end, uh, the snorkel uh, hoses come up um, underneath. And I'll show you, trying to show you underneath where they come. Um, so this one here, uh, that comes from um, the back of the belt box. And they simply just, you can kind of see, they simply just go up. Um, just behind the electric fan. Um, you can kind of see them there. Uh, also, one comes up on the uh, on the right side of the machine. And then I'll go around. And I'll try to show you over here. Um, and then the other ones come up. Uh, one comes up on the left side and then the, I have my air box tube uh, coming up um, in the middle. Uh, so the three, so this this line I bought, I got off eBay. Uh, it's one and a half inch uh, flexible flexible uh, PVC pipe. So it's not really flexible, but it's hard, um, and it uh, it's very uh, it's very good quality. It's uh, it's what they use for uh, for pools and spas and and what have you. So. Uh, as you can see here, um, this is a three and a half inch silicone coupler uh, to a two inch uh, silicone coupler. Uh, so this is the uh, this comes up, and that is the uh, left side snorkel, um, and that's the one that comes up the right side underneath, and then up in front of the electric uh, electric fan, and then it attaches to that uh, two inch silicone coupler. That then it touches to the snorkel. Um, so yeah, so three and a half uh, inch down to two inch uh, for the uh, for the front of the belt box. And then I'll show you what I did on the back. Uh, the back, um, what I've done is I've used a three and a half inch again to two uh, to two inch. Uh, silicone coupler at the 90. Um, that's all it really is. Let's try to show you on the top. Can't really see because it's underneath, but you can see. So this this tube here, um, that's the tube that goes to the left side of the uh, of the machine, 
and then, or sorry, the right side of the machine, and then up to the right snorkel. And that's attached to the uh, two and a half, or the two inch by three and a half inch 90 degree silicone coupler. I didn't want to use plumbing fittings. Um, I just got these on eBay. They're not expensive. Um, and uh, I mean, that's what they're designed, designed for. So my air box, uh, like I said, I didn't want to uh, have the uh, four snorkels. So all I did is I removed the, uh, the factory um, little air intake here that comes here um, I used I just found I had a, uh, a rubber a blue Rubbermaid container here uh, at home I just uh, cut a piece out um, screwed it and silicone it underneath uh, it makes a good seal I tested it uh, with water before I put it on it's sealed and then on the air box itself I'll try to I don't know if to see so you can see it there so the white piece here uh, I drilled a, a two inch hole in the side of my air box and then I used uh, a plumbing fitting and I'm not sure the technical name um, but one the side that is the, the it's a two-piece uh, fitting uh, the side on the part on this side of the air box uh, is threaded and on the inside of the air box, um, there's another piece that threads onto uh, threads onto the outside piece, so it clamps it against the air box wall. And then I simply siliconed it. Again, I tested it um, with water before I put it all back together, and uh, no leaks. And then the last piece, um, it's hard to see. The last piece. Um, is a 90 degree uh, one and a half inch PVC uh, piece you can see here um, this white piece, the white piece in there is a one and a half inch 90 degree angle um, and then I simply attached uh, a small piece of straight one and a half inch ABS I put a two inch silicone coupler on it and then um, the flexible PVC hose into the other end of the coupler and then this is the center snorkel so for those uh, cost me about a uh, hundred and thirty dollars a hundred and forty dollars with the paint for the snorkels um, to do this uh, I'm very happy with it uh, it runs runs fine runs great uh, no issues with uh, only the one snorkel um, I've only had her out a few times but uh, there's not I haven't noticed any uh, performance issues. Uh, the air box lid doesn't uh, suck down when I'm under power and uh, it doesn't seem to be starving for air with only the one tube. So that's what I did. Um, just thought I'd share is uh, when I was doing this, I, uh, I was looking at videos to see there wasn't a whole lot with, uh, with only the three snorkels. So that's what I did. And I thought I'd uh, do a video to uh, show the rest of you for anybody that's interested.